What role does the third eye chakra play in increasing your clients? In this video, I'm going to talk about the third eye chakra in your energy body and in your business's energy body and the role it plays in attracting the quality and quantity of clients that you desire in your business. So I'll also give you a couple of strategies that you can implement to just make sure that your third eye energy uh, is aligned with the clients that you want. So the third eye chakra is uh, one component of it is about having the big vision. And I often compare it to the eagle view of the landscape, the eagle eye view, where the eagle's up and looking over the whole landscape. But then the eagle will dive down and get caught into the detail, go into the detail and then come back up. And this is what your third eye is about. So it's not just about the big picture. It's also about going down into the detail, breaking it down into goals and strategies that will take you towards that big vision. Uh, and for many of us, either we don't have a big vision or we just get so lost in the big vision that we forget to go back down into the goals. And so where this comes into play in terms of your clients is if you don't have a big vision, if you're not clear on a big vision for your life or you're not clear on a big vision for your business, how are you going to attract clients who are ultimately going to take you towards that big vision? By big vision, the way I often look at it is you dreaming your biggest dream. You don't know how it's gonna become a reality. You just know in your heart that this is what you would really like. And you play with it just like a little child would when they state what they want for their life. No idea how it can happen, no logic. This is how you come up with your biggest dream. What makes your heart sing? So you can do it for your personal life and it's really important you do it for your business too so that your business has its big dream as well. And so then what it's about is making sure you stay on track towards that big dream so you attract the right clients. Now the big dream can change and that's fine as long as you've got a big dream. It's like a magnet that, that draws you along the path, that draws your business along the path. So so that you're attracting in the right clients who are aligned with that dream, the important things to do are basically get a dream for you and get a dream for your business. That's it, okay? Play with it, play with it. Just let yourself just brainstorm what you would really love in your life, how you would really love your life to look. Let your third eye just have a field day. Do it for you do it for your business. You can add it, you can add to it, you can tweak it, you can change it whenever you like, but have that there. And then the third aspect of this is when you are coming up with strategies, when you are coming up with goals, when you're breaking it down, so you're looking at your plan for the year, your plan for the quarter, your plan for the month, your plan for the week. When you're doing those plans and setting those goals, run it by your big vision. Is it taking you closer to that? Because if it is, energetically, you will attract the clients in who are taking you closer to that big vision. Now here's the catch. This is what you've got to be careful of. FOMO and, and shiny bright object thing, <laughs> okay? If you are distracted, oh my God, that looks great. Look, she's doing that, that works really well. And you go down that path and actually, that's not aligned with your big vision or your business's big vision that's going to put out a different energy to your clients. So you are gonna start attracting clients that maybe will take you down that path, but they're not necessarily aligned with your big vision. So constantly just being like the eagle, seeing the big vision, going down in the detail, coming back, look at the big vision again. Am I on track? Back in the detail, okay? So these are the things you can do to support your third eye so that energetically your third eye is attracting in the clients that you want. Okay, so please, if you like what I'm saying, hit like on this video, comment below, share. Does this resonate? Did it, does it make you think, oh my gosh, I've got to do something about my big, big vision? Would you like to share your big vision? Please just leave some comments below. And, uh, and if you would like to 
know more about the chakras, especially in relation to your business and your business as an entity, then I invite you to pop over to my Facebook page. Um, I'll pop the link below. It's bit.ly slash Jacqueline FB. FB is uppercase. So I'll pop that below and you can find out a lot more about the energy body of you and your business. So let's get you co-creating with your business. Until next time. Bye.